This edition enters the dark world of the stalker, the obsessed fan. We've heard the realities and their many victims. From Steven Spielberg to final girl favourite Adrian King, movies and TV shows have covered many aspects of the obsessive fan. This next piece is an anime classic that cuts deep. Satoshi Kon's Perfect Blue. I watched this about 20 years ago after hearing some great things. I remember it being quite a mindfuck. The blurring of reality, the cracking of the psyche. This pop idol is stepping away from singing to become an actress. Her obsessive fan is none too pleased about this. Her first role is a difficult start. Uncertain, uncomfortable, and seeing the face of a man who she had seen at her pop shows, her stalker. Aye, okay. So, let's go. Hi. 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 She begins to hallucinate about herself back as a pop star. Her mental state starts to crack and then the people around her start to die. As I said regarding Gantz, animated movies have the capacity to do more than live action. It's able to take you into harsher realities, to show you things that are harder to digest. No actors to push beyond their limits. This is twisted psychological horror, edgy and uncompromising. <laughs> <laughs> it was well received by the critics and was hailed as a masterpiece. It's not for everybody. It can open up old wounds to those who have been tormented by the self-righteous. I believe horror exists to challenge us, and in some ways an education rather than something that can desensitize. We all react to Freddy Krueger in different ways, since he's a different kind of stalker. His original canon was that he was a paedophile. The township come together and set his place on fire like he's a Salem witch. I'm not sure what kind of point I'm trying to make except that stalkers are like sharks. They exist in our world. And whether you think this is your kind of movie, People loved Joe Spinell in the movie Maniac. That kind of obsessive struck a nerve with so many. Perfect Blue is a great movie with a relatable arc. Yeah,